Yo guys, what is up? This is Tom from Unreal Meta and today I'm gonna show you how to make falling snow particles in Unreal Engine 5. So let's start. So first I've got the snowflake texture, you can see it here. I took a snowflake PNG, then I just desaturated it so it's fully white, made it brighter full brightness and then I blur it and make sure it's a PNG because we need a transparent background and then we can go to new material let's call this snow underscore material go into that and now drag the texture in okay make sure to click on the snow mat the blend mode has to be translucent and then you can plug this into base color. The alpha goes into the opacity and we also add a multiply node for the strength of the opacity. And you can see it already here. It's just a light effect. So let's set this value to something like 1.5 and then we can save the material. Once it's saved, let's close this tab and now we can right click go to Niagara system and create a new system from selected emitters. What we need here is the hanging particles, then click on this plus and then finish. Now let's call the snow underscore system and we can go into that. You can see the particles on the top left, how they move, how they behave and they are literally just flowing in the air. And we want falling snow, so what we do is we click on hanging particles, then go to particle update and scroll down to forces. We need this gravity force, just click on that, it is applied. And under gravity force, you can see the Z value is minus 980. Because the gravitational acceleration of the Earth is minus 9.81 meters per second squared, so we have this value of minus 980 and you can change it because that's a little bit fast. Let's change it to minus 600 so the snow falls a bit slower. And another important step we need to do is click on this little material icon and then select our snow from here. The snow material, then save everything and you can close this tab. Now, if you place the snow system a bit higher, you can see the snow is actually falling. It looks really nice, really cool. And we can adjust it a little bit. So let's go into that. Let's say we want more particles so we can go to spawn rate. Let's increase this to something like, I don't know, let's say 400 because we want a lot of snow. Then we can also go to shape location and just increase this to like 1000 by 1000 by um, let's say 600 and save this. What it does is just it makes the box where particles spawn bigger and now we can close the tab. You can see there's just more snow in the scene. If I click on the snow system it looks like this. You can see it very clearly and then let's drag this over the scene. And in full screen, it looks like this and without the yellow hitboxes like that. If we go from lit to unlit, you can see those particles very clearly and it just looks like nice snow. Now you know how to change the opacity, the acceleration, the speed, the size of the box and so on. If you haven't seen my tutorial on dust particles, it works just the same way. And I hope you liked this video. If yes, leave a thumbs up. If no, leave a thumbs down. I'll see you next time and bye.